Hey everyone, big news for the Linux world. Pop OS fans, this one's for you. The long awaited Cosmic Desktop beta for Pop OS 24.04 LTS finally has a release date September 25th. After years of development, thousands of GitHub issues closed, and seven alpha releases, the beta is finally here, and it's more than just a desktop. So let's rewind a bit. The Cosmic project started back in 2021 when System76 made a bold move to step away from GNOME and start building their own desktop environment. Written entirely in Rust. Not a skin, not a fork, but a completely new desktop environment built from the ground up. Now why did it take so long? Simple answer, because this isn't a small project. We're talking about writing everything from scratch. The window manager, compositor, panel, settings, core apps, app launcher, all designed to be modular, secure, and super performant. That's a huge undertaking, and it's why Pop OS 24.04 itself was delayed. But here's the exciting part the beta isn't just cosmic, it's also the first beta release of Pop OS 24.04 LTS itself, meaning you'll finally get to try both together for the first time. And even though Cosmic's been in alpha for quite a while, it's already shown up in other Linux distributions repositories. That's pretty rare for software at such an early stage, and it just shows how much momentum this project has. With this release, Cosmic is aiming to challenge the big players, GNOME and KDE, that have dominated the Linux desktop for years. Will it pull users away from GNOME? Well, we're about to find out. So mark your calendars. September the 25th is when we finally get to put Cosmic Beta through its paces. I don't know about you, but I can't wait to see what System76 has pulled off after all this work. What do you think? Could Cosmic actually become a third major desktop environment next to KDE and GNOME? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I'd love to hear them. And as always, if you found this video useful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss my full review once the beta drops. See you in the next one.